engineering and building an 80,000 ton cruise ship. Hello everyone, welcome to Tech Hand. In this video, we will take you on a journey through the incredible engineering and building process of an 80,000 ton cruise ship. From the design and planning stages to the construction and commissioning of the ship, we will give you a behind the scenes look at what it takes to bring a cruise ship to life. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Let us know in the comments that you're subscribed and what you think of this video. We'll reply to you personally. You can also give a thumbs up. Thanks for that. Let's dive in. Engineering Department Onboard Cruise Ships Engineering Department on Cruise Ships is responsible for the maintenance and operation of the ship's technical systems, including propulsion, electric power, HVAC, and sewage treatment. The department is typically led by the chief engineer and staffed by a team of trained engineers and technicians. The engineering department plays a crucial role in ensuring the safety, comfort, and smooth operation of the ship, as well as maintaining compliance with environmental regulations and standards. Roles and Responsibilities of the Various Departments on Board On a cruise ship, there are several departments that work together to ensure the smooth and safe operations of the vessel and provide a high-quality experience for the passengers. Some of the main departments on a cruise ship include Deck Department, responsible for navigation, safety, and maintenance of the ship's deck, including lifeboats and tenders. Engine Department, responsible for the maintenance and operation of the ship's technical systems, including propulsion, electrical power, HVAC, and sewage treatment. Hotel Department, responsible for providing passengers with accommodations, food and beverage services, entertainment, and other hospitality services. Medical Department, responsible for providing medical care and assistance to passengers and crew. Safety and Security Department, responsible for the safety and security of passengers, crew, and the ship. Purser's Office, responsible for managing passenger accounts, handling money and valuables, and providing general information and assistance to passengers. Shoe Excursions Department, Department, responsible for planning and organizing shore excursions and other activities for passengers. Cruise Ship Design Cruise ship design is a multidisciplinary field that involves combining the principles of marine architecture and engineering to create a safe, comfortable, and attractive vessel that can accommodate a large number of passengers. Key factors in the design of a ship include size and capacity. The size of the ship and the number of passengers it can accommodate are critical factors in the design process. The design must ensure that the ship can carry enough passengers to generate revenue while still providing adequate space and amenities. Safety. The design must ensure the safety of passengers and crew, including compliance with international maritime safety regulations. This includes factors such as stability, fire protection, and evacuation planning. Passenger amenities. The design must provide comfortable and attractive accommodations, dining options, entertainment facilities, and other passenger amenities. Environmental impact. The design must take into account the potential impact on the environment, including emissions, waste management, and water pollution. Propulsion and power systems. The design must ensure the ship has efficient and reliable propulsion and power systems that are capable of providing safe and comfortable operation. Cruise ship interior design. Cruise ship interior design involves creating an attractive, comfortable, and functional environment for passengers with the goal of making their cruise experience memorable and enjoyable. Key factors in cruise ship interior design include functionality. The interior design must ensure that all spaces are functional and meet the needs of passengers, including cabins, dining rooms, lounges, theaters, and other public spaces. Style and appearance. The interior design should reflect the style and aesthetic preferences of the cruise line and the target market and should create a memorable and attractive experience for passengers. Comfort and convenience. The interior design should aim to provide maximum comfort and convenience for passengers, including ergonomic, furniture, adequate lighting, and well-designed public spaces. Materials and finishes. The interior design must use high-quality materials and finishes that are durable and able to withstand the demands of a cruise environment. Branding. The interior design should incorporate the branding and image of the cruise line in a consistent and appealing manner. Safety and accessibility. The interior design must comply with international maritime safety regulations and must be accessible for all passengers, including those with disabilities. Cruise ship interior design is a complex and highly specialized field that requires the collaboration of interior designers, architects, and engineers to create a safe and attractive environment for passengers. The design must take into account the specific requirements of a cruise environment, including durability, accessibility, and compliance with maritime safety regulations. New Expedition Cruise Ship Designs 
Expedition cruise ships are designed specifically for adventure travel and exploration to remote destinations. Some of the latest and innovative designs in Expedition cruise ships include ice strengthened hulls. This allows ships to safely navigate in polar regions, providing access to areas previously off limits to tourists. Increased sustainability features. Many new Expedition ships are equipped with advanced environmentally friendly technologies such as hybrid engines, battery packs, and wastewater treatment systems. Systems, larger viewing platforms. These provide passengers with better opportunities to observe wildlife and scenery in their natural habitats. Advanced navigation systems. This allows ships to travel in more difficult waters, increasing the range of destinations available for exploration. Modern amenities and comfortable accommodations. This enhances the overall experience for passengers, making extended trips more enjoyable. Damon Shipyard's new Expedition Cruise Ship Design. Damon Shipyards is a Dutch shipbuilding company that has recently introduced a new Expedition cruise ship design. The ship will feature a robust and efficient hull design, as well as modern navigation and safety systems to allow it to operate in harsh weather conditions and remote destinations. The ship is expected to offer comfortable and spacious accommodations for passengers, as well as various amenities for onboard entertainment and relaxation. The design may also include features specific to Expedition cruising, such as a research facility, a helicopter, after landing pad and Zodiac boats for shore excursions. Sunstone's world-class expedition cruise ship design. Sunstone Ships is a company that specializes in the design and construction of expedition cruise ships. They have introduced a world-class design for their expedition cruise ships, which is meant to offer a unique and high-end experience for passengers. Some of the features of the design may include spacious and comfortable cabins with private balconies, a range of dining options, and a variety of entertainment venues. Additionally, the design is expected to be environmentally friendly and energy efficient with a focus on reducing the ship's carbon footprint. STX France Ulysses Cruise Ship STX France is a subsidiary of the STX Europe Shipbuilding Company, and the Ulysses project is likely a new cruise ship design being developed by the company. However, specific details about the project are not publicly available. Based on the name Ulysses, it's possible that the ship is being designed for luxury, long-distance cruising, and may have features such as spacious and comfortable cabins, multiple dining options, and entertainment venues. The ship might also have advanced navigation and safety systems, as well as environmentally friendly technologies to ensure a smooth and safe voyage for passengers. Wind Cruise Vessel Design a wind cruise vessel refers to a cruise ship that is designed to be powered by wind, typically using sails. This type of vessel is a modern take on traditional sailing ships and combines the timeless charm of sail-powered vessels with the comfort and amenities of modern cruise ships. The design of a wind cruise vessel can vary, but it typically features spacious and comfortable cabins, multiple dining options, and entertainment venues. Additionally, a wind cruise vessel may feature a large deck area for passengers to enjoy the views and sea breeze. An outdoor space for relaxation and recreation. Main Plant and Environmental Engineering in Cruise Main Plant and Environmental Engineering in Cruise refers to the system and technologies used to power and operate a cruise ship, as well as to manage its environmental impact. The main plant of a cruise ship typically includes its propulsion system, such as diesel engines or gas turbines, electrical power generation system, HVAC, heating, ventilation, and air conditioning system, and waste management system. These systems work together to provide the power, comfort, and services that are essential for a safe and enjoyable voyage. Environmental engineering in cruise is focused on reducing the impact of cruise ships on the environment. This can include measures such as reducing air and water pollution, minimizing waste, and conserving energy. Some examples of environmental technologies used in cruise ships include advanced waste management systems, such as those that can recycle and treat sewage and wastewater, energy efficient systems, such as LED lighting and heat recovery systems to reduce energy consumption, emissions reducing technologies, such as scrubbers to reduce sulfur emissions from diesel engines, renewable energy sources, such as solar panels or wind turbines, to reduce the reliance on fossil fuels. Are you enjoying our video? Before we get further, make sure to click subscribe and turn on the notification so you don't miss out on more amazing videos from us. Let's continue to explore the cruise ships. 
Entertainment Department. The Entertainment Department in a cruise ship is responsible for providing a range of activities, shows, and events to keep passengers entertained and engaged during their voyage. This department is typically led by a cruise director and includes a team of entertainers, musicians, and event coordinators. The types of entertainment offered on a cruise ship can vary widely, but may include live music such as bands and DJs performing in the ship's various bars and lounges, stage shows such as musicals, magic shows, and acrobat performances. Movie screenings, often in a dedicated cinema or theater, games and trivia events such as bingo, karaoke and quizzes, dance classes such as ballroom and Latin dance lessons, poolside activities and games such as water aerobics and volleyball tournaments. The entertainment department may also offer a variety of activities and events for different age groups such as children's programs, teen activities and adult-only events. Additionally, the department may organize shore excursions and other activities in port such as scenic tours, cultural experiences, and water sports. The entertainment department plays a key role in creating a memorable and enjoyable experience for passengers and helps to create a sense of community and social atmosphere on the ship. Guest Service Department The guest service department on a cruise ship is responsible for ensuring that passengers have a comfortable and enjoyable experience during their voyage. This department is typically made up of a team of guest service officers who are available to assist passengers with any questions or needs they may have. The responsibilities of the guest service department may include answering passenger inquiries and resolving any issues or concerns they may have, assisting passengers with making reservations for onboard activities, dining, and shore excursions, managing the check-in and check-out process for passengers, administering onboard purchases such as spa treatments and souvenirs, providing information about the ship, its facilities, and the ports of call, assisting with any medical or emergency situations that may arise Guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Let us know in the comments that you're subscribed and what you think of this video. We will reply to you personally. You can also give a thumbs up. Thanks for that.